all right guys this is gold and h4 uh, h1 chart now i can see in h1 chart gold is running uptrend uh first we must find out the find out the most uh, important point and you can say key point or you can say entry and exit point so how to, how we identify entry and exit point so let me draw some uh, horizontal line so which call support and raise them i'm gonna connect this point uh, here so why i connect this point let me show you somewhere here so this line uh, i can see price are rejecting again and again so somewhere here price hit and a reverse break price hit and a reverse break means uh, this line around say here four eight and uh, two uh, let's say three zero okay uh, this line form as a right now uh, i can see they are form as a raise 10 line and uh, somewhere here we have seen multiple rejection from this area rejection 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 means this line act as a support and raise them here they act as a support and uh, somewhere here they act as a resistance so that is why we drawn this line and it is a probability to react as a support and resistance now so that is why we drawn uh, here at the level of 48,230 somewhere here let's draw another line here uh, this one 100 moving average somewhere here sorry 150 moving average now why I connect this line let's see so if you want to see here uh, price goes up to this level and retrace back toward moving average 150 this one and bounce from this area means in h1 chart 150 moving average act as a support means they are bouncing from this area after that they run sideways and they broke this level and gone up now somewhere here we have seen uh, where in this area 150 exponential moving average so why we don't it is a probability to bounce from this area because they act as a support in our previous market behavior so that is why we are expecting it may bounce from this area now question is that can i go for buy now here my answer is no why we need a breakout now you can see price still running below this uh, horizontal resistance line okay so still they are running below this horizontal line okay so means we need a breakout so once they break this level if we've uh, seen any uh buy confirmation so definitely we'll go for buy above this raise then line now let's see in a small time frame like 15 minutes how to look like that in a 15 minute chart you can see price still running in a downtrend okay so my question is that which moving average will flow uh, time frame we will follow one hour which is uh, running in an uptrend giving a retracement but in a 15 minute they are running in a downtrend and they are bouncing of moving average 20. so here you can see uh, price drop from this area price uh, create a new high drop from this area and pull back toward moving average 20 have you seen it and again bounce from this uh, moving average 20 again retrace toward moving average so it is a probability to uh, continue uh, down uh, toward downside okay so most of the data like uh, who are uh, uh, like you can say intraday data so if you want to enter for short or you want to go for sell direction uh, so let's see after breaking this lower point and you just close your position somewhere here why because this is a strong support sometime what happened price goes up create a new high and fail to break new low somewhere here and bounce back from this area okay so that is why we must close our position if they break this level so definitely we will go for short so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching